Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2. And in the last episode, we made some pretty sick progress. We are exactly one galaxy away from the very last galaxy in the game. I mean, besides the special world. From getting all the dang green... Oh, fuck, looks like we've already started this galaxy. I totally forgot about that. Oh! I remember now. Yes! We, it's been so long since I recorded. We did Boo Moon Galaxy, the first green star in that one, which was an absolute dick. But now, we are on to the next star. I gotta tell you a story, though, about this. I was, uh... Right after I finished recording, I thought the game had saved after I got the star. I was so worried about getting the star. And when I finally got it, I thought the game had saved, and I immediately just turned the console off. It did not save, so I had to go back and do this first star all over again. But luckily, luckily, I saved it four times before I turned the game off yes. the next time. So now, we, we're on to the easy stars now. The, the, the hard road is over. It should pretty much be copacetic until the very end. The last star is gonna give us the, the run of our lives to try and complete. But I think, all things considered, I, I take all my amazingness and then I, I wrap it up in Mario and I think, like, I've, I've got what it takes to do this. I think, at the end of the day, Mario and I are going to go all the way. I just need not to, to kill myself in the process. That is, that being the issue, me dying via myself. I think you can just like, jump straight down. Yeah, I dang right you can. I'm t I'm t it's all coming back to me, man. <laughs> Dog, the freaking Mario Master of the Universe. Oh God, yeah. Just, how many times? That is that part right there got me so many times. I kept running off the ledge because it just juked me immediately when I had to go back and redo the star you know, when I wasn't recording. Just juke me, man. Just juke me right off the freaking right to the death. Okay, here we go. We can do this, Mario. It's me and you, partner. Okay, how do I... Don't go too far. Oh, my God. Dude, he, he like... He made, I, I don't go too far, and he immediately just long jumped as far as he could. Okay, I won't go for... Tried to go to another galaxy. He pretended he was a launch star, like himself was a launch star. The color's a little bit too bright. I, I got the new TV, ladies and gentlemen, and I found... The original, um, that's right. The original uh, remote that went with it on eBay, and I just picked it right up, and I adjusted it a little bit, but I think I, I boosted the color a little bit too much. Let me bring it down just a just a hair, get it a little fady. Let me turn the picture down just to get it nice. That way it's not too bright. Yeah, yeah, dang right, man. All right, let me just, just get on out of here. There we go. Just a little bit. The same problem the last time with the other TV. It was just like a little too red. There was just like a little too much color on the screen. But this is, I mean, I'm looking at the capture device, which is what you guys are seeing and what I'm seeing on the television, and it is just about completely accurate. I think the capture card's a little bit more faded but that's fine. I'd rather have a little bit more depth in the color here anyway. Man, I got to hung out with Anna the other day. She is such a nerd. She, like, talked to me about all these games she used to play back in the day. Like, all the nerdy stuff, like, she used to do with her friends. Like, used to watch MLG and freaking X-Play and all that stuff. I'm like, girl, I know exactly what you're talking about, but you said it first. So, that, like, yes. you're being the nerd right now. She's like, no, I'm not a nerd. I'm a girl. I'm like, yeah, you're a girl, but you're a nerd. I don't care. Why don't you get upset and freaking blog post about it? I don't care. And that's exactly what she did. She's like, oh my god, my boyfriend's so mean. Wah, where's my dog? And then she proceeded to cry and watch dog videos because that's all she is good for. Freaking. <sighs> Never. Never. Anyway, that was my weekend. Dog okay, well, none of that happened. Actually, what really happened was 
I didn't mean to get that so early. Oh god! What happened? Actually, I started telling her about like Halo 2 and like how big of a deal it was back in the day wow. and how it was like the first MLG game ever. Freaking Team Carbon for life, boy. I was like trying to. Explain. I was. Pl oh god, no! God, I hate. Oh, I hate it so much. I, I hate it so much. The unlimited amount of despair for this 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 map. Just this one. Just this one. The rest of them are fine, but this one can just die. I just want it to, to die. After I beat this game. After I get that last green star. I will never play this game again. I'm gonna sell it in a yard sale for 25 cents or 11 quarters as one of my good friends says. Anyway. <laughs> I, I, it was so weird. I was playing Halo 4 and like explaining the whole situation in the game and whatnot and how important Halo 2 was. But what was so weird and the TV was completely to blame for this. Like, I haven't played the original Halo 2 very long time and uh, and when I started I played the first level and then you know how like the very next level is the Metropolis level uh, right up there <laughs> uh, We don't need one of these stars at all. We just need to get good. Do I need to like long jump? Yes, I do. Oh god! Okay, so I'm gonna stand like right here because this is where I need to be. And it, it was so weird to play in that game. It literally took me straight back to like 2005 or whenever that game came out. I really can't remember the, the exact date. But it just, it took me straight back. That's probably gonna be the thumbnail. That is pretty cool. All those ghosts. Um, it was just, like, all those old memories of, like, going over to friends' house. I mean, I think about those all the time, but just, Halo 2 was, like, the beacon of that because everybody was playing Halo 2. All my friends, me, complete strangers, we were all playing Halo 2, and it, I don't know, it just brought us together. Like, I remember one particular time we were trying, like there's this guy we used to play with named Jake, and he was the best. It was either between him or a girl named Rachel that we used to play with. Like they were the top dogs in the Halo field. Not so much Call of Duty, but uh, definitely the Halo. And uh, I'll never forget going up against him. Knowing I wasn't going to win, we were testing our BXR abilities because that was a thing in Halo 2. Yeah, he was really good, and I, I never figured it out how to BXR properly. I was always too slow at it. I wasn't against the idea of doing it, but I was just never really good at it. I heard that star. Oh, I already hear it again. I hear it again. Hang on a second. It's got to be here in this area. Whoa, whoa. I feel like I'm getting closer. Oh, oh god. There we go. I think it's right up there. There he is. Okay, I see what needs to be done here. I don't know how I'm gonna get enough upward momentum though. Like what I need to do. Ah, okay, you see what I'm saying? Like that's No! Okay, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. This, is gonna, this is gonna take some some skill here, like some timing, dude. Now I went completely the wrong way. Alright, so like we got we gotta backwards do the backwards thing. Ah! Just like that. It's like you have to spin jump to counteract gravity going down, but like there it switches, but so it's hard to it's like move, it's hard to time. Oh, it's obviously not too hard, but we are gonna break the 200 mark in this video. I know it, I can feel it. It is 100%. But now one thing though, 
it's like hard to explain it, and I just couldn't really notice it, I guess, on the other TV. Uh, going from HD back to standard definition is kind of hard on your eyes. It's, it's kind of... I may just be crazy here, maybe. Probably not, but I may just be crazy. But I just, for some reason, the other day, my eyes just could not focus. Like, it was just... It wasn't like it was hard to read, but it like had this fuzz about it, and I just, what is going on? Like, I cannot focus on this. And I hope it's not the TV. I'm, uh, I was unable to find the service menu and how to access it on, in the manual. I'm already put the manual for this TV, because I'm trying to, it's got some things going on in the top right corner that I need to fix. Uh, uh, it's kind of just like pulling. It's like doing a pin cushion kind of thing. And I just, it, I mean, it can be adjusted. It's not like broken or anything like that. But, oh, come on. I should be able to make that. It's like it's completely fixable, but I need to be able to access the service menu to fix it. I don't know how to do that because every TV is different. I, I should. I tried to, I tried to beat the Goomba. Don't ever try to beat the Goomba. I could probably just like, I'm so close. Oh, and there's the next one literally right in front of me. Okay, so I probably gotta get like underneath. Oh, this okay, this is gonna be harder than I thought. Oh, maybe. Hang on, let me I, I'm gonna have to get on top of that. Can I, like, fall up and... Oh, not do that. Not do that. Okay. Oh, man. That's gonna suck. Oh, man. How am I gonna... Could I, like... Okay, this is gonna be kind of weird. Could I, like, backwards long jump through that up gravity and it still, like, carry my momentum through it and then jump out on the other side? I don't think so. Well, maybe. Or do I need to like fall like really quickly? Man, this is this is gonna be awkward. Dude, I can't. Okay, hang on. Let me go. So I need to like go up here and then spin jump back down. Ah, okay. All right. All right. I was trying to think about like long jumping and. Uh. It's a little bit confusing. Dang, shifting gravity. Man. I ain't too good at that stuff. I like things to stay the same. I'm not against change, but I'm not about learning new things if I don't need to. If I don't like to read, I may find a word I don't recognize and I have to look it up. Actually, I don't like to read because I'm the slowest reader in the, on the planet. Guaranteed. But anyway, I've been okay. Still haven't beat through the fire and the flames, but then again, I haven't really practiced it since the last time we hung out. I will eventually. I was thinking about it this week sometime. What I'm probably going to do is I still want to get some, like, practice in, like, kind of just hone my guitar here in this a little bit before I try it again, because I'm honestly this close to getting it, and I just want to just do the best I can. Anyway, we're at stars. I, anyway, today I probably won't try it, or if I do, it'll be a lot later when I do. Oh! <laughs> and that thing got me every single time I've tried to do this. I feel like it has. Okay, this sucks. What's down here? Hopefully, some coins. Because now I'm in trouble. Oh my goodness. Let there be coins. Yeah. Alright, that's enough. Thank you. Don't need this. No spank you. If I'm not back in five minutes, just wait longer. Tick tock, tick tock. Oh, apparently. Oh, man. It's funny that we're doing this right now. There was a. Uh, I watched a YouTube video yesterday about this uh, particular level. Apparently there's like this secret on here that not everybody really knew about. Or they knew about it, but they had no reason to really do anything. Chickens. There's apparently 
pretty sure the first brain cell is going to do something. Try not to. Yep, there it is. Um, there's like a, a set of. Uh, there's a set of one ups towards the end of one of these, like, long, snaky kind of two sand things. And I'm gonna try to get them if the next star is anywhere near that. Like, Oh wait, let's do this just in case. You never know. You might just screw up completely. So, but, you know, had I known they were there and like it was like a big deal for people apparently because it's really hard to get to. It, apparently it takes five real world minutes of jumping and spin jumping to get to. I'm probably not going to waste the time here to tell you that I'm not going to do it. But I would like... See if I can do. I mean, I'm sure you can. It's just it's, it's the sand is moving against you, and you have to jump and spin jump, and then get as much horizontal distance with the spin jump as possible, and then immediately jump again and spin jump again. So I mean, it sounds not easy because like any given second you could screw up and just absolutely just like reset your progress. It's one of those, except it's going in the opposite direction. Where's that second star? I'm not to do oh, is that it lady out there? Oh no, I think it's on the slip slide actually. If I remember correctly. I, think it's I was trying to get hit by this. The dog! No! Oh thank you. That's right. I have learned the pattern. Pattern of justice! Let's just walk right through these like we own the place. <laughs> Which we kind of do. I did buy this game. I didn't rent it. I'm not renting Super Mario Galaxy for the Let's Play. Excuse me, Mr. Metal Block of Miss Prime. I had a conversation yesterday with a guy about Bionicle. And I told him, like, he said, man, there was like these Lego robots I used to play with. And I couldn't think of that. I had no idea what he was talking about. And then he, he sent me a... Uh, text message that said, Bionicle, that's what it was. Like, oh yeah, I remember that. And then I told him about the Mask of Light movie. And he said, dude, I didn't know they made... I didn't know they made uh, movies. I said, that's the only movie I know of that's Bionicle. He said, oh, okay. But then I thought to myself, well, I haven't seen him... I haven't seen the movie yet and I've had it for like a year. Left side... Oh man! <laughs> just happened to see it like right when it. Just, I was I was a little too overzealous. So I'm gonna. I guess I'm gonna watch Bionicle Mask of Life pretty soon, so I can let him borrow it. Oh, dude, I missed that. There was no, I did not. I was not there. Thank you. I completely missed that. Just so you and I are clear. The farthest pic pixel to the right was the only one I did at that time. But yeah, I've been living a Vita Loca pretty much, just hanging out, playing some Halo 2. God, it's so weird how it just, it just took me straight back, man. Just all those episodes of X Play and freaking televised MLG. Like, God. has it really almost been 20 years since that, you know? Cause I was 10 years old in 2003, and I'm, I'm gonna be 30 in like four years. Time just flies, man. I think I'm glad I was there. You know, I had a great time, played a lot of games, a lot of friends. But it's just a shame, you know, that it's just a shadow of the former self. And G4 doesn't exist anymore. I'm just glad people have archived a lot of those videos on the internet. I wish, though, and I know I've said this in a lot of videos. I wish G4, whoever owns G4 now, owns every episode of every show that was ever on G4. And I can't think of any reason as to why they, well, I can think of one. But I can't think of a, a good reason, I should say, as to why they don't release, like, the shows on, like, DVD or Blu-ray or something. Like, make them uh, standard definition. I was talking to Josh about this. I said, uh... 
the same thing. You know, there's no good reason. I can't think of why they wouldn't. I mean, I do now. I think I think I know the reason why they would do now, and I'll share that in a minute. But I was talking about it. I said, man, whoever owns G4 now owns like X Play and Attack the Show. You know, whatever, whatever other. I mean, there's a lot like cheat and uh, Code Monkeys. Just anything that was on, like, Cinematech, Nocturnal Emissions, somebody owns that, like, they own that show now, and all the episodes that ever aired on that show, and it's, like, I can't think of a good, oh, God, a good reason as to why they wouldn't do that. And then I thought to myself, it's like, hey, a lot of those old shows were recorded in standard definition, so, like, they're technical. Before DVDs were like a thing thing, well, I guess they've mostly probably been converted by now to either flash drives or DVDs, uh, or Blu-ray probably at this point. There's probably some that are still tapes, like old episodes of X-Play archives tapes. Like there's probably, like that would be something to have. Imagine having the first episode of X-Play that was... Uh, oh, here, here. Oh, no! No! <laughs> I was thinking to myself, oh, I hear it, but is it on the right side? I can't tell. And, uh. Anyway. But yeah, I, like, that'd be amazing to own a tape of the first, like the first unedited uh, recordings of the first episode of X-Player, first episode of Attack of the Show with Kevin Pereira and Olivia Munn. Like, that would just be the coolest thing to have, you know. But I don't, like, if they still have all that old archives and stuff, I don't know why they wouldn't, just, like, reproduce it once more, like a, a G4 throwback or something. And just, like, release, like, like, if I can buy the Brack Show and freaking Space Ghost, I should be able to buy X-Play and all the cool little commercials and skits that they did in between. Like they called it like a G4 spot or something. Or it's like, I think it was called the G spot or something like that is what the uh, commercials were called. I don't remember correctly, which is an amazing sex joke that they could put on television. That is the best. But I, I just, I'd love to be able to buy that stuff again and watch all those old reviews, freaking Morgan Webb and Adam Sessler all over again. Is that it? Oh my goodness. Apparently they hated each other for whatever reason. I, somebody told me why more than Webb hated Adam Sessler. I don't. I can't. And then Adam Sessler, I think he has his own YouTube channel now. Uh, uh, I don't know what Morgan. I think Morgan Webb. Is she working for Epic or something? I think she's working for like not Epic, but some game developer. Know what Kristen Holt's doing? It's not Holt anymore. I think it's Kristen Adams. How many times am I gonna have this conversation with myself on? The, that's that's the answer. I want. Yes. Dude, I hear the star right now. There it is, right there. All right, Fluzzard. Me and you gonna let's do it. Don't need no Fluzzard. Fluzzard. He says you're okay when you glide with him. Yeah. Will you glide with Fluzzard? Why, heck yeah. Do you need a tutorial? If you can glide through the big sun circle at the end, you actually. If I get the dang star that's right below me, I win. So get it right, you freaking bird. Go straight down, straight down, straight down. Yeah, dang right. I wonder where the second one is. Oh, I, dude, I already remember. See, we're getting kind of later in the game now. With the green stars, and some of them are starting to kind of come back a little bit. Uh, this one, I think, is behind a pillar on the left. Yeah, we got plenty of time to get it. It's not gonna take us. It's gonna take us a hot second to get it. I think I know exactly what it is. I think this is the level that kind of falls apart, and it's towards the end. It's behind a pillar, and you have to wait for the pillar to fall, and then just like glide in behind it. If it's if it's that one, I'm pretty sure it is. You only get to fly with Flutter twice. Yeah, I miss those days, man. That was, that was good stuff. But you know that that's a problem at the same time when they remake games because sometimes they'll remake them with modern controls and it doesn't exactly 
feel like the old game, and I just, it, I don't know. Once again, the best way to play old games is to get a freaking CRT TV that works. <laughs> game I thought about the other day though that I hadn't seen in a long time. I, I'm gonna die. I'm already lost. Um, Mortal Kombat Deception. I thought about not going through conquest mode again, but just plug, just turning it on. Because that game is good times too. I'll never forget the first time I saw that. The dang cooking with scorpion video. That was the funniest thing, I swear. Me and John used to joke about that all the time. Can I just go straight? Do I even need to? I'm just gonna go straight. What was I thinking going around? I think waste of time. Get that. Oh, God. Oh, please, 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 please. Let us get some control here, please. For some reason, it's just not. It's right over here, behind that purple thing. I know. Oh, heck yeah, I'm high enough. Heck yeah, I'm high enough. What do you think? Hell yeah, I like that belt. Fluzzard, it's been a privilege flying with you, but I don't think I'll ever see you again, partner. Thanks for your service and all the stars. How many stars do we get collectively with Fluzzard? Yeah. One for... Yeah. I think it's one, two... Three here, and then four green stars, or two green stars in total. Well, no, it had to be four green stars in total. Maybe five. Somewhere between seven and ten stars. Fluzzy, you the man. I, I will miss you severely. Separately. Yeah, I need to figure out how to get these service media this thing. I think the focus might be off just a little bit. I, I don't know for sure. It's kind of hard to tell. That may be what the issue with the, my eyes, like adjusting to it. The focus it could be off a little bit. You can fix that stuff in the service menu. Actually, if there's an option, there should be an option for this. But, uh... All right, let's take a look around. I think I know where this one is. I think it's on that planet we just passed. I'm pretty sure. Let me take a gamble just to be sure. Oh, there's one over there. I think I'm already seeing it. What kind of jump is that? It's exceptionally high. You hit me. You hit me. I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. Oh my god, it's in the freaking. There it is. There it is. I just happened to hear that thing. I wonder if like this lava actually hurts you though. Oh my god, okay. What 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 was I doing? What I have to turn it into ice. That is this map. That is, that's this map, Sam. It's not the dang green line. This is obviously my first time playing Mario. Obviously my first time playing Mario. Please get that cool Mario before you die again. So jump back. Okay. I probably screwed up. You just need to give me that ice, because ice is twice as nice. I am going to go backwards. Okay, you cannot ski as Cloud Mario. Duly noted. Alright, give me that star, boy! Of course they put it right in the middle of the volcano. Why wouldn't they? Why wouldn't they? <laughs> Just be sure you turn off the lava first. Just turn off the lava and everything will be fine. It's worth the time, please. I don't think you're right for what you will keep doing you. It's been my absolute pleasure. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Hopefully we'll get to around 215. Probably won't get that far, but I'm gonna try. So thank you for watching. Keep our keep your cats, kittens in the next episode. It's my absolute pleasure. Keep it real and peace.